So how's everybody doing this afternoon? Yeah, we uh, had another one of those interesting days that uh, did freaking nothing. <sighs> it's all right, though. It's uh, more of crazy train. That's what I do, and that's what I've been doing, serving. And found out I missed Deb's birthday. That totally sucks. She's missed mine, too, and... The whole thing's kind of been a disaster. It, uh, you know, we really did screw up the first grip, and uh, it would have been a whole lot better. But it's, uh, it isn't what we got. No, we have to work with what we got, and what we got is a mess. But uh, he's saying that there's going to be a chance here shortly that uh, we'll actually get to friggin' finish a movie and make this thing happen. I hope so, because uh, I'm telling you, I don't know how much more I can take of this, you know, that, that service, yeah, wow. It has been entertaining over there, very entertaining, the whole adventure of uh, these, I don't even know how many weeks now, probably don't want to know, yeah, let's keep it at that, yeah, don't want to know, a long time, too damn long. We'll just go with that and uh, know that, uh, you know, he, he does have this, uh, and supposedly everybody's doing what they're supposed to be doing, and we're right on with what he wants, and uh, that everything's going to be cool. Uh, I, that's the best I got out of him, uh, you know, uh, and trust me, it, it's hard to accept that because, uh, you know, he's told me cool a long time ago. And next thing you know, I'm in a psych ward. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's been fun. It has been fun and entertaining. Bullshit. Yeah, sorry. I, I, I have to say that. I, I literally have to tell you the truth. And the truth is it's been bullshit, but that's okay. We're going to be all right. It's going to be all right. I, you know, he's, we're one, so he's torturing himself, too. But uh, we're working on it. You know, that part is kind of confusing still. So, you know, how many times can he hit his own hand with a hammer? I wonder that. What do you think? I don't know. But me being the hand, I'm feeling it. So, uh, he's saying it's going to be cool, though. It's going to get much better. And, uh, you know, it really has to. Because we're, this is a common sense thing. It really is. You know, we talked about it this morning, about uh, the healing and uh, the uh, what God actually does here. Yeah, and, and bear in mind, there are times when it serves him to heal people. Or to inflict them. And he'll do that. It's the same thing with money. There are times when it serves him. On your path. To bring money into your world. He did it to me. Way back. I, I, I got money one time. Just out of the blue. Yeah. And uh, you know. It, it served him at that time. It gave us one last good summer. Before everything went to hell. Yeah. Me and my kids. But uh, he'll do that sometimes. So to, to say that that would never happen, that's not the truth either. The truth is he does what he does to help us on our paths. And so what I'm mainly bringing to attention is, you know, if, if you need help, you can talk to him about it. But understand he's going to give you the help that's best for you. Yeah, yeah, you could sit there and beg for a million dollars all night long, but uh, probably I wouldn't overdraw your checking account on that one. I, I would uh, keep yourself intact because, uh, yeah, that's probably not going to happen. So, um, you know, it, it, you got to remember, it's about working with us. That's what he does all the time with every single one of us. Sometimes it's tragedy in our path. Sometimes it's a miracle and a surprise. And, 
you know, you got to understand the mystery of what he's working on and why he's doing what he's doing and what it was about. Usually works better to get through it and then you understand more and you can reflect back and say, oh, maybe that's what he was trying to get to me. Yeah, I understand it now. But, uh, yeah, don't don't spend a lot of time begging and, and, and praising him, hoping that you're uh, going to get your wish. That's not how this works. That's not how it works. And uh, that's what I'm supposed to be explaining and uh, making you understand. That, uh, that he, he's not a wish guy. Uh, I mean, we'll be on the top side, and you'll find out that uh, you can make your own wishes with your own magic if you got any and that's the idea I really need everyone to come up there with magic and a good scorecard that's uh, really the evolving of mankind that we need we got enough white walkers we really do we need angels and above and uh, that's uh, the common sense of what's going on here and hopefully uh, world peace at the same time and everybody realizing they're an eternal being if you don't screw it up in boot camp remember that's what everyone has to remember you are eternally never going to die unless you choose to be stupid here and then well you chose it free will anyway I gotta get back to my crazy world. Deb, I'm sorry. I, so sorry. You know, they really did screw us and we're really still paying for it. And I am sorry for that. I'll make it up to you. One day I'll give you the universe. <laughs> well, you know what I mean, Father. Yeah, we, you, you, you get what we're going at, yeah. It's gonna be all right, eventually, forever. It's gonna be all right.